Hello and good evening to the last race of the first round of the Fire Red Leaf Green Race Tournament 2024. I am joined today very happy, happily by my good friend Nerdy Nerd. Good evening, Nerdy Nerd. Yo, what's up? And also good afternoon to those joining us from North America. Uh, All right. Yeah. Yeah, um, today we have a interesting duel match between Kuka and Bouncy. Uh, Kuka, very uh, known as the em emu emulator world record holder for this game. And uh, Bouncy also with a very good time. I think Bouncy has a 203, if I'm not mistaken. So very high stacked horses. Yeah, what do, what do you think about this match? Yeah, I think it's going to be a really, really close matchup. I haven't seen either of them um, play the game too much in the last while, but they're both like extremely strong runners and uh, could go either way. Exactly, could go either way. You know, both of them running early search, meaning they could get a lot of pain and trouble during the search split, also with rival three, three on the board. So... Um... There's bound to happen a lot of funny stuff in the early to, to mid game. Yeah, it should uh, should have a lot of excitement. Cooper is running on uh, emulator, so he'll have to wait a little bit before starting the race. So Bouncy will have a small lead, but eventually it'll catch up and become even. Also, Bouncy is running on DS, so it's I, I believe it's a uh, slightly slower. Very slightly uh, the console, so it should make it even closer. Yes, Keck W. Hey, hey, hey! Don't bash hey, the hey. DS. <laughs> yeah, um, let's have a look um, at the turtles. Both are running. Cooker is running a mild, which is I think the first of the tur tournament, and Bounty is running a modest. Uh, mm -hmm. Formerly, all the racers uh, mostly ran Rash because Rash is one of us is the best na nature out of the three, but interesting that Cooker opts for a might. Yeah, it's interesting because Cooker won't have any issues with, uh, well, likely won't have any issues with Misty. Um, but damn, look at look at that HP, thirty-one. That's that's pretty crazy. Yeah, picked out a pretty good total. Yeah, it actually might help out with Koga with keeping the uh, torrent uh, more more chances too. So it might it might make up for it. Yes, exactly. The the higher your HP IV is, the longer you can spread the range in which you have torrent, uh, which is formerly uh, which is used um, throughout the whole run, uh, because if you're in tor torrent, your water attacks deal 50% more damage, which we will uh, ex exploit for most of the parts of the run. All right, both runners have started. They're um, going for it. Are, are they going to go for a minute? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> has anyone gone for a minute this tournament? Um, I think no one even try tried it, no. It, it would be such a giga chat move if someone <laughs> actually got it, but I don't expect it to happen. Yeah, I mean... All right, yeah, there's the bouncy reset. Oh, Cooker with the top, top memes. <laughs> oh, man. I, I, I love, I love this dude. So, you know, uh, the Sarge decided, so Swirl is the best, uh, the best out of the three for the whole game. So they're going for that Swirl, and uh, in normal attempts, people go for the Minip, which is a one frame Minip to um, hit a certain Squirtle with certain nature and IVs. Uh, but if you don't hit your Squirtle, you are allowed for this race to have a backup so you can reset and uh, use your backup Squirtle instead, which both these racers are seeming to do. Exactly. Yeah, after this uh, first rival fight, we they will leave the lab. Oh, he he missed attack him. He might actually oh. die here if he misses another one, but he doesn't. Okay, uh, they will leave the lab and then they will um, 
enter route one. I mean, we, we heard and said this a lot of the times um, during the other races, but we will gladly re repeat ourselves. Both of them have to oh. catch a cutter and a flyer during this race. Uh, one for TM cut and one for uh, one for HM cut and one for HM fly. And uh, you can actually catch both of them here in this route, which Bouncy enters now. Uh, or you can, or you have uh, several ch chances later in the early game. But uh, we will we will explain that when it when it comes comes to that. Plus, they also uh, need to kill one wild encounter here at least uh, for early experience, which is needed for for the Brock gym. Yeah. I'm expecting a few saves in this split. I'm wondering if it's going to be over or under three saves for this Brock split between the two runners. I can think of a couple of places to save for. You mean uh, three saves for both of them or individually? In, in, in total. In total, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I I guess I guess it depends on the H HP which will they which they will have for uh, EG semi, because if you are very high HP for semi and you have access to a bubble, if you enter if if you're level seven just like bon bon uh, just like Bouncy is now, uh, you can actually. You you don't act, actually have to save for for semi, but um, that's fair. Uh, better save, like both save are, sorry. Yeah, it seems like both runners are going for bubble. I, I like this strat. It makes it so you can't miss taco. Plus, I believe it does slightly more to the uh, wild encounters that you're trying to catch on the on the second pass through route one. Is that correct? I, I, I think so. Oh, that, I, I didn't think that that was a question, sorry. Um, as I am a very experienced runner in this game, I actually don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I mean... Uh, it's the, more the, of a race strat, to be fair. Yeah, I mean, the, the big upside of using Bubble for uh, weakening wild encounters is that it cannot miss. Tackle yeah. is a 95% uh, ac accuracy and Bubble is 100, so Bubble actually never misses. So, um, that's why some runners opt for going bubble early, especially in races. Yeah, sometimes 95 can really feel like 80 or 75, but it's nice to have that guarantee. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Both re-enter the lab, they, they grab some balls from Pro Professor Oak, poke Pokeballs, and... Um, yeah, then the, um, they try to catch at least one wild encounter. Which can yeah. be a lot of tr trouble because they have to, or they usually have to weaken it once or twice. Uh, one tackle or one bubble puts it usually in a 62% catch rate or range. And um, yeah, sometimes even a 78% seven, range. But we will see this now. Not the end of the world if they don't get any uh any hm friends because there's a couple uh, uh, a couple ways to get them later yeah friends <laughs> good bounce he gets an encounter what it is uh pidgey okay pidgey 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 that's a oh. 62 percent oh god okay he should potion yeah wise wise choice <laughs> That's a little loud again. <laughs> oh, he's bubbling twice. And oh, Kuka, and... Kuka crit, crit the bird, nice. That's so nice. Yeah, both of them actually get their first wild encounter or the, their, their first catch here, and both of them uh, catch it also because it's a 100% catch range. Uh, catch range, and yeah. We're almost bird... synced up, actually, yeah. Yeah, the bird usually does does more trouble than the red because red only knows uh, red knows tackle and tail tail whip, which is 50-50 to use, and the bird only knows tackle, so you are almost guaranteed to get damage from the bird while catching. And Bouncy runs into a Rattata, which is useful for him, and Kuka gets a Pidgey, which unfortunately has to run from. All right, 
Uh, seems like both of our runners will have both of our HM friends, so we won't have to worry about that anymore for the rest of the run. 62% for Kuker, I believe. Uh, yeah, Kuker's catch is 62%, yes. Oh my god, what is oh this? Oh my one? god, I'm just doing Both have the potion on World 1. This is really, really something. Oh my god, that was scary. Okay, oh no! Okay, he might he might opt to bubble again to get a guaranteed catch. Oh, he goes for it. The thing is, the the next tackle is gonna hurt, hurt like a truck if he gets. Okay, he gets it now. Okay, very nice. Yeah, it's a really sucky situation if you run out of pokeballs. Which fortunately for this game you can get a, you can get the Pokemon to 100% catch rate. So you'll if you play it right, I I don't think you can run out of balls without your HM friends. But I mean, I mean you can run out of balls. You just have have to buy some more, right? <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Money is usually a bit tighter for real any percent glitch glitches uh, attempts, but in a race, uh, many people or many racers opt for selling nuggets um, along along the way so they can buy more X items later in the in the game. So I yeah. don't think there would be an issue to buy two or three more balls here. What is Bounty wait? What doing? is Bounty doing? Wait, what? What? Is he cheating? <laughs> wait, what? Yeah. Okay, that is a very bold move. Into <laughs> it! You to level 5! What?! Okay, wow. Oh my gosh! Get what? away. Okay. That was I terrifying. Have, I have never seen someone use this path. <laughs> I really hope Cooper goes around the grass. <laughs> yeah, or, or it's some new hidden tech which I didn't follow. <laughs> It's actually extended the up. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Alright, I think that's the uh, third encounter for Bouncy. Yeah, Bouncy picking up here the, the, the uh, second yeah. portion of the early, early game. He will now pick up a uh, third portion right next to Semi. I think both of them will. Did you catch if uh, either runner picked up PC potion? Uh, PC potion is banned. Oh, it's banned, okay. Yeah. Oh, right, because of the, uh, backup portal. Right, right, okay. Okay, Bouncy okay. can save, but Bouncy was, Bouncy was, was pretty healthy, and he has bubbles, so... Uh, I can, I can understand if people don't save here. Okay. They both also have bubble. Let's see if Cooper saves. I believe he, all, he has one potion. Okay, he doesn't. Yeah, both of them should have two potions at this point. Uh, but Cooper used a potion on Route 1, doesn't he only have one? Yeah, but he... the potion he used... Oh, was potion guy. Mark, 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 was the Mark guy potion. Yes. Mark guy, yeah. I think Galaxy also picked up Mark guy potion. Yep, they all did. All did okay. Potions. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. Okay, Bouncy all, already done with this fight. That was pretty fast. I mean, also thanks to oh, uh, critting. But he but, doesn't have a uh, poison. Yeah, he didn't get poisoned. And Kuka also struggles with getting poisoned. I think he gets one one more chance. Come praying. on, poison. No. Uh, I, are they both on the same HP? Uh. Oh I, no, I, I think I think uh, Kuka just leveled. Okay, I think yeah. They are something like six, 16 or 18 years. So the reason why you want uh, poison is so you can, what uh, Bang was talking about earlier, Torrent adds 50% to your attacks. Um, so what Torrent does for this gym, it, it helps a whole lot. It turns the Sancher that Bouncy is now saving for from a, fav I believe it's a uh, favorable two shot into a unlikely three shot without Torrent. Exactly. And that uh, Sandra has sand attack, so it can get a little scary. Yeah, both of them are saving, makes sense. 
I mean, Hopefully, I mean, it's only yeah. wise, wise here. If you if you don't save and, and lose, which is a good possi possibility, is a good possibility. You you are spawned back at mom's house, I think, at, at your mom's house, and you have to do all the walking again. Yeah, it's extremely bad. I wonder how how weird it would be to walk into the poker center and walk out just to avoid saving. Sure, you could actually do do that. <laughs> Okay. Oh, Krasi misses. It's a, he just needs to hit one. Just hit? Good. Nice, okay. It's uh, Cooper's turn. Yeah, Bouncy also ex exiting this, this fight with, with very, very good HP. Yeah, like you also want... Uh, yeah, wow, that's that's perfect Torrent. You want Torrent for Brock as well, because it uh, makes his Ace Pokemon the Onyx a... Is it a 9 and 16 range? Uh, with Torrent, is it's a 9 and 6 and 16 ranges. Yeah. And it's really important to try to get uh, Torrent after Brock, uh, because when you head into Route 3, Torrent just helps a whole lot. It saves like something like 4 or 5 turns. It saves a whole lot of time. Cooper heading into Brock with uh, a lot higher HP, but he'll, he'll probably stall. Or maybe a turn or two. Mm -hmm. Come on, hit the hit the range. Bam! He gets it. That went pretty smooth. Uh, Bouncy will uh, will lose torrent now for level thirteen. So he has to stall on the first tra trainer on the next route uh, once. Uh, or rather, he has to take one tackle to get Torrent for 14, which is actually... It's not, man man it's, it's not mandatory for this route, but it's, but it's very help help it's very helpful and saves a lot of time because uh, all the bugs then are one, one shots and not two shots. Or well, most of them are two shots then. Okay, yeah, now Kukur is stalling, trying to get a little bit lower HP. I think maybe he'll stall one more time, yeah. And now he will go for the kill, now that he is in Torrent. Just gonna get crit. Okay, nice. Alright, pretty good start for both of our runners. Bouncy with a very solid start, I think. He has both HM friends. Uh, Cooper also does, so... Yes. It's not too bad. Yeah, I mean... Considering they they uh, both don't have to catch any friends anymore, it's it's, it's a pretty good Brock time. It's like a yeah, high 15, mid 15. It's it's pretty pretty. It's a very it's it's very solid. Oh, I see that bouncy sold rock too. I don't think I'm too familiar with that uh, with that route. Is that to buy more potions? Did you catch how how many potions he he bought? I believe he bought eight, which I th I thought was standard. Uh, usually you you buy seven pots, three antidotes, three awakenings, and then four repels. But ah, I mean, okay. if he sells rock rock tomb, or if he sold rock tomb, he can buy more potions, sure. But um, you buy the fourth re repel because you pick up re revive in mount in mount room, which helps through right. the whole early early game early on. Yeah, so you can so you can pick up the revive as well. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah, Cooker, Cooker bought uh, seven potions, three antidotes, three awakenings now, and let's see, four repels. Yeah. Okay, so it actually it actually checks out. You don't even have to sell rock rock tube, but maybe it's for later pur purposes. Who who knows? Who knows? Uh, is Bouncy stalling on the second caterpillar? I think he tried to stall off. He, he, he tried stalling off the first one, but he right, yeah, it. he's slower. Okay, yeah, makes sense. Okay, that's pretty troll. Getting spring screenshot like four times or like three times already. He he needs to get tagged now, otherwise he will lose a lot of time. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. really sucky. Yeah. He yeah, still has one more chance, but yeah. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, you should keep it. 13 out of 39, I think. Yep. Yeah. 
Yeah, Puka didn't have the stall because he, he exited uh, Brock's gym with very good HP. He has Torrent for whole round, uh, for whole round 3. And yeah. Bounce, Bouncy will lose Torrent at level 15, which is not that bad. But uh, it's it's only for the last fight that he doesn't have Torrent. Yeah, and you can see how much Kuka is already saving up, like just from Torrent. It's it's yeah. pretty crazy. God item. Okay, and that Torrent allows them to one shot everything in this fight. So just see no hiccups here, except for say. Yeah, uh, round two pairings will be right after this race. We'll have a short commentary with the, uh, with the runners, and then we'll get into that. Yeah, would you mind walking us through Mount Moon and all the tra trainers you could fight fight there, Nerdy? Uh, okay, let's see if I remember. Okay, so yes. <laughs> you, you need some experience before you get out of Mount Moon. So you have, I think it's four possible trainers that you can fight, or... Yeah, there's four possible trainers that you can fight. Uh, one is the Budcatcher. Uh, he's usually this, like one of the safest. There's also, I think his name is Josh. He has two Rattatas and a and a Zubat. You usually use him if you want to, if you're a little bit out of Torrent and you want to get a, like one, maybe two quick attacks to get back into Torrent. Because Torrent also saves a lot of time in Mount Moon. Uh, then I think there's a safest guy. The hiker, I haven't seen him in a while, but you just one shot everything on his team and he gives a lot of XP. He can't do any damage. And then there's Bane's favorite Risky Rocket. Risky Rocket! Where you fight, and he, he's pretty risky. I doubt we're gonna. Yeah, I, I doubt we're gonna see him this race. Usually for PB attempts. But he's the fastest out, out of all of them, for sure. Yeah, I mean, if we see it here, we might see it from Bong Bongshi because I think he is at 15 HP and he has he has a modest so he tanks one Hyper Fang, so Kuka will not will not go for for Whiskey Rock because he is I think he's at 13 or 12 HP. He will most likely fight Josh or Hiker because Hiker also gives the most XP out of all the four fights. And Bongshi will oh. go for Risky Rocket. Yes, okay. Risky, Risky, Risky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I he's gonna pick up the revive, right? That makes it a little bit better. Yeah, he's going for the revive, so if he dies, it's not the end of the world, he can just revive. Yeah, both runners have it. Both go for Risky Rocket, what? Wait, what? Kuka also does it. Oh my god, it's a double Risky Rocket fight now! Oh god, what is this? Oh no. Oh god, we could see a double death here, oh my god, I'm so Oh bad. no, I, feel, I have a bad feeling about this. No one ever dies, dies to this point. Okay, Taco looks good, I think. Oh! It's a range! No! Both don't get the range! It's a, oh. it's a good range, actually, actually. It's like the Onyx range from, from, from the Brock too. That's think. not a good range, that's 50%! <laughs> okay, so both go for Risky Rocket and both of them get punished. Fair, fair outcome. Because you're trying to get into Torrent, so they both had to potion. They're almost yeah. synced, synced up. <laughs> they didn't die. That's true. We actually will see a double if double evo evolution screen here. Oh my god. It's so close. We're getting double Oh my god. Yeah. Oh that's so nice. So so nice to see. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, the upside of this fight is they did die, uh, but otherwise I cannot say say much good about this we're, fight. <laughs> we're like a few frames off of completely synced up, this is this is awesome. Yeah. But yeah, the em emulator will, will catch up now. Goofy just looks like, like he's running faster. Man. <laughs> so fast. <laughs> Wait, how is Bouncy yeah, I thought, what? Okay. It's so nice, nicely in sync over it. It's so great, man. Hyperfect oh. actually is pretty good. Okay, yeah, it's very good. 
Now he has Torrent for level 18 also, which means that he uh, can wreck Handy after this fight if he levels up. Yeah, but now... I don't, I, 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 I don't think he will level up here. Or, I mean, no. It's, it's very close. Oh, Cooper got confused. Oh, oh boy. But hey, he has Torrent now. Is he gonna... Does he have any, enough HP? Uh, yes. Okay. What's also uh, not notice noticeable now was that Crooked didn't pick up Personberry. Personberry is used uh, pri primarily for the Mis Misty Gym, where where we will face two Water Pulse users, and Water Pulse can can confuse you. Um, Kuka didn't pick it up because he has Mild, and Mild will uh, almost every time I think see Swift, and Swift uh, just doesn't con just doesn't con. con it will just yeah, all the time. that's that's correct. So it just doesn't make sense for Cooper to pick up Personberry, because if it if it didn't get used, he would just have to unequip it to equip the black classes later, which is just a time loss for no reason. Yeah, exactly. Oh, he missed the water gun range on Coffin, which is a 40 and 60. Wow. Okay. Yeah, luckily just... poison gas also missed. So. I respect it trying to keep the trying to keep the race close. <laughs> yeah. Was sure, surely. Oh, Cook got disabled, that's why he bubbles. And he hits yeah. the coffin range, okay. Alright, now we're gonna be heading into the mystery fight. After picking up uh I think what is a rare candy? Oh, also after teaching Mega Kick. The best move in the whole game, game. God, I hate it. Is it 75 or 85% accurate? I can't 75. remember. That is just awful. Yeah, you. I think you were thinking about Mega Mega Punch, which we will not use in this in in this run or race. Yeah. But it's very powerful. So. I mean, it's a Mega Punch, of course. And yeah, uh, yeah. Mega kick, the the one move we we all love and hate. We have to use mega kick for a lot of fights, um, primarily on Odysseus and uh, and Rats, but uh, also for both rival fights we need to hit se several kicks, which is pretty annoying because, as we just said, kick misses a lot of the times, and for a lot of fights it's, it's really really bad if you miss kick because that most of the time means you. Either have to heal or you just die. <laughs> There's some spots on bridge where it's all right, though. I think against Odishas, most of the yeah. time it just it's, it just loses time. And there's not much power points for it, so you would have to be right early, and it's, it's just a nuisance. Okay, so now we can see Bowser heading into the Misty Clay. He did say. He did not save. I mean, okay, they both have the re re they both have have the revise ready save. So yeah, I, I guess yeah, I guess with the revise, you can just skip saving until you lose it, and then you can start saving for fights. Yeah. All right, so this star you usually goes for Harden, and it's a likely two shot. You just don't want to get confused. Oh, okay. <laughs> Commentary first. Yeah, so you don't want to get confused from it, and you want to kill it in two shots. That's the main goal of that one. But the big threat is a Starmie. It's an unlikely, very unlikely two shots, but it's possible. Let's see. And you just don't want to get confused, you want to just, just kill it. Alright, so Bouncy just trying to dwindle it down a little bit more. So Misty doesn't use a Super Potion. And Bouncy is through, nice. Yeah, you that want to was, take Cooper's? Yeah. That, that was an as standard fight as you can get with, with Misty. And Cooper's just having an easy star rate because it's just only using Swift. I think that's pretty good HP, isn't it? If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, yeah. Cooper doesn't even need to heal for the rival 2 fight, yes. Yeah. And oh, but he's mild. Uh, is it 17 to 20? Uh, I think it's 18 max, if I'm not, if 18 I'm not max? wrong. 18 max? From Vine, Vinewood is, is what you mean, right? 
Yeah, it's eight yeah, minutes. Yeah, Vine Whip. Okay, okay. Yeah, so he one-shots uh, the Pidgeotto four out of six, six, four out of 16 times, which you usually want if you don't get quick attack, but uh, yeah, he survives one Vine Whip, which is uh, very, very help helpful for this fight. So you basically get two Mega Kick chan chances. Yeah, there's just so many scary fights in this game. I would just kick in and just save everywhere. It just, it would... Let's see how this goes. Oh, that's not a... Is it good? Uh, I don't think it's good. I think that's not... Oh! Why didn't he heal? Why didn't he heal? Now Wait. it's weak. Now, it, now he has to eat... Nah, he, he, he cannot heal this. He, he, has, he has to bite flinch. Oh no. Goes for the heal. Okay, he he bought uh, additional potions, so he can't actually go into the heal Kido Pier. So he's gonna heal again. Yeah, okay. I th he, he might heal again after this fight. Fine with but no, now now he's safe. He only right, dies yeah. to a one to a one six sixteen now. So yeah. Cooker missed the Pidgeotto range and he healed. Oh, he gets a sand attack though. That's no, that's not good. It's really bad actually. And he didn't swap. Okay. He goes, he goes for sweep, okay. Bouncy, please hit this kick. No, he's dead! Oh, no. He has to revive! Okay, both of them are actually really much uh, str struggling here with getting slapped, missing kicks, having to heal, or it's not yeah, a good yeah. side. Terrible fights and, all around. Yeah, Bouncy didn't save, which can be quite sketchy now. I it, didn't catch it, if, if, if Cook is saved. Yeah, I didn't catch it either. Now we, he only has one more chance to kill, right? Okay, he okay kills the bulk sword. What a boost! He's he's dead what? because now is he's an overgrowth. Yes, he has he has to reset him. Oh, oh god. my god! This is such a train train wreck to watch. <laughs> it's early game. There's still plenty of time to catch up. Okay, at least he did save for this fight. Yeah, <laughs> it would it would be really bad if he didn't. Okay, Bouncy is through after uh, an interesting fight. Let's hope that Cooper gets through on his second go around. He gets quick attack again. No, that's All right, don't again, don't but... hit the range now. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay. That's okay. Not bad. So he's under half. So I don't think he should get the sand attack. Yeah. Or he was at half. Alright, now he just needs to hit a bite into a mega kick to knock out this Bulbasaur. Okay. Oh, so nice. It's okay. There's another chance. The amount of kicks already missed in the last two minutes is too damn high. Yeah, this is why I don't like this move. Okay, you <laughs> really need to hit this kick, otherwise he needs to either revive or reset. Okay, thank god. He is fine now. He also does need to heal for the quick attack from the red because it does 7 max with his de defense uh, and na nature combo. But he he might opt to a potion nevertheless to, to not get too low for the next upcoming fight. Okay, he does. Okay. Yeah, uh, Kuka also done with this fight. Good good job, guy. Nothing happened here. Uh, now yeah. they, are, they are entering a section which is called Nugget Bridge, which is just five, or rather six fights, uh, which go by with nothing much really ha happening aside from one Oddish, which you could kick, but you can also bite bite in races, which makes the fight a lot more consistent. Also, if you want to adjust your HP to get Torrent, most of the runners opt to bite bite, which we will most likely see here with Bouncy. We see it, nice. Anti-Crit, wow. Very nice. Okay. Even better than a flinch. Yeah, after this audition, I mean, as I just said, nothing much happens on this bridge. You just water pulse or water gun can torrent everything or bite one or two things and then you are good, good to go and uh, yeah you get a nugget as a prize woohoo which you can sell later for uh, yeah for your shopping tours which you will do later 
Uh, that's, that's actually a funny thing. If you um, you get the nugget before you fight the last train, train trainer, which is actually a rocket. So if you fight him and 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 die, you can get infinite infinite um, amount of nuggets, which makes it rich, which is actually quite quite fun. <laughs> when is uh, when is rich percent? Rich rich percent. And also, yes, uh, love Sakira. Uh, yeah, DS runs at a very slightly slower frame rate than uh, GBI uh, console does. So, uh, but it's like seven or eight seconds, if I remember correctly, over the entire run. So it shouldn't be too big of a deficit. Just my con con console cooker. <laughs> oh my god, it's Mankey. Dodge. Mankey! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so now Bouncy is gonna get that nugget that Bank was talking about, so you can sell that later to buy more items. Uh, mainly X items, so we can use that in battle to beat trainers easily. God, it was actually a rocket? What? What? He, and he tried recruiting us? No way. And we couldn't even say yes. Wish we could. Yeah, as a as a child when I played this casu casually I always wanted to join team team rocket and do a stupid stuff. <laughs> but you're a good person, thanks, you can't. Aww. Thanks. I only mentioned game. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so I think Cooper is two fights behind, but not too far behind. Can definitely catch up. And especially, I, I think uh, Bouncy doesn't have his revive anymore, so he'll have to start saving for certain fights. Definitely has to save for Surge. And pro most. Uh, yeah, definitely will save for Book Rival. I believe. Yes. A heap. Bouncy might be ahead two two fights now or one and a half minutes something like that. But the big the big um, advantage Cooker has that he has, as you just said, one spare revive which he can use in certain sit situations of fight. Um, so Bouncy might up to ooh, nice, oh. nice pass. yeah very nice pass to save for certain fights rather than uh, just going risky. Is, is that the Shiru pass? I. I think Shiro does it a bit differently, but it could also be the Sh Shiro pass, but, but it looked pretty smooth. Yeah, it's very nice because uh, there is another way to pass. I, I believe his name is Dan, if, if I'm not forgot. Uh, yeah, so you can let the hiker walk up and see you, and then if you run up, straight up and then start walking right uh, when you're passing him, he, there's a 1 in 16 chance for him to see you. So, but that pass has uh, guaranteed, so it, it's not risky at all. We'll probably see it from Cooper, so as he lets the hiker walk up to him. It, it's more difficult, but getting rid of that 1 16 is the main benefit. Yeah. I mean, even if you, if you should see, see you or if you fight, fight on purpose, it's, it's, it's not the worst option to it because he only has a slow, slow, he only has a slow poke which dies to one bite, so. Some people even face, face him because they, they want to, because then they have Torrent for level 25. Um, but yeah, both of them opt to not fight her, or him rather. And yeah, and as you can see, uh, Cooper got passed and got the 1 in 16, so very nice. And on the other side, you saw Bouncy pick up that Orin Berry. Uh, it's, it's very useful, because when we're going up to Koga, we want a very, very specific HP. So that we survive a sludge bomb, but we're also in torrent. So we can hit some ranges in one shot. I believe it's a one shot, yeah. A one shot on Weezing. It can, yes. Yeah. Also, Bungshi missed two uh, his, his two, uh, two kicks here, so we just opt for, for bite. He just said, screw it, I will bite, bite now. Oh, did he miss two kicks? He missed two kicks. <laughs> uh, yeah. Classic. Yeah, 
uh, such a, it's, it's one of the biggest moves in this in, in this run, Mega Keg, Keg W. Is skipping Mega Keg a <laughs> viable option? <laughs> I mean, if you want to finish the, the, the run, yeah, sure, but <laughs> not on a top top tier time. Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> and then for the race track, but still probably, it's probably pretty bad. Because Mega Keg, it, it misses a lot, but it's a very strong move that we can use for strong Pokemon. Yeah. Uh, Bouncy actually has good HP for rival 3 here, I believe. What is this HP at V24, which means uh, he gets 2 on the level up to 20. Oh, Koop is, Koop, is Koop resting? Okay. It seems like. Yeah, he misses the kick. But he didn't get punished, so. Yeah, I think... Ab absorb only kills you. Haha, <laughs> he is out of case. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I mean, yeah. Oh, he, he gets the one watcher with water pulse, which is not, not very likely. Yeah. Good, good guy, Kuka. Yeah. Now we obtain the SS ticket for um, the boat, which is in Vermilion City. We fight our rival there again, which is also a very diff difficult fight because we also have to hit. Who would have guessed? Kickstarter. <laughs> And um, yeah, both of them, especially Bouncy, will 100% save for this fight. Yeah, then even after the rival, we have to go fight Surge, get some cans in. There's just so many scary fights in a row. You're, you're like n almost never off the hook in this game. Yeah. Alright, now Bouncy is fighting this rocket. Uh, or he has to hit, guess, you guessed it, another kick. After a water pulse. I mean, you can't even uh, water gun this if, if he is in torn, which makes the tra transition to Mega Kick also faster, but this is just a uh -huh. side note. Wow, he, hit, he, he hits a kick. Ooh. Very nice. Yeah, I, I think Bouncy missed more kicks than he act actually hit in this race. Which doesn't make sense, but hey, it's Pokemon. So with early search, they're going to do a late boat heal, right? I believe. Uh, they boat heal after the rival fight. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You there's a there's another very po popular race route or race thread. That you do late search, meaning you de de you delay search to a later time in the race. But uh, Kuka and Bong Bongshi are both are both old old farts, and they just do, they like to do early <laughs> search. The bouncy also getting citrus berry, very interesting. Yeah, I also did this in my race, which is a god god sweat, which basically Ooh. gives you another chance to kick on the on the search fight. Oh god, Kuka misses his magic fit into okay. It doesn't oh. go. Into a disable, so he has to use water pulse. Gets through and, though. Yeah, Kuka's on Kuka's on 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 the edge for for the last couple of fights. He has a revive, so he can get away with it. But without a revive, you just have to play it like, super safe. Yeah. Is the idea of uh, Citrus Berry you equip it for the search fight and then yes. it kills you? Yeah, you uh, equip the cit Citrus Berry after Rival 3 and before Surge, so that at, if you get hit by Shockwave and miss your Water Pulse or Kick, the idea is that cit Citrus Berry heals you to an amount of HP where you can tank another Shockwave, basically meaning you get another shot at Water Pulse or Mega Kick. And that's, that's, the, that's the whole point of picking up this, this, this berry. Now we are at the SSN for Bouncy. He has to do a small menu, menu here with the rare candy and ether, or did he yeah, already? He's do gonna it? no, he, he's gonna delay it so he can save in the same menu. Ah, yeah, true. Smart boy. I guess he already ethered because he missed so so many. Yeah, kids. it makes sense. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Is 17 HP enough? Oh, I guess um, he'll heal turn one of. Uh, Ivy Sword? Or. Yeah. 
there's a lot of things he can do. He can he can potion turn one on bird or super potion turn one on Ivysaur. But let's just see what he does here. You can also get quick quick attack here, okay? One, one shot now. Okay, cool. Now he's gonna heal. Yeah, he has, he has, he has to heal. Yes. And then hopefully a standard fight. Standard fight. You heard us, game? Standard. He goes for kick turn one. I, I thought it was fight in the It actually is. Is he doing laser oh, it, oh maybe he, is he trying to get into the torrent by giving Ivysaur overgrow? But it isn't an over, over it, it isn't an overgrow. But this Oh yeah, fair. Yeah. Okay. I'm a bit I'm a bit confused fused here, but he is ba basically done with the fight, so let's oh, just go go it, with it. It's to avoid leech seed. Okay, that oh, makes the, sense. Yeah, chat is being smart. What a big brain. Okay, like time for Cooper's fight. That was a very good quick quick attack because now he is a uh, bite. Is yeah. bite times two guaranteed to kill Pidgey Uh, quest questions, man. <laughs> I have no clue. I guess not. Otherwise, we 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 would do it. But I I, I think you always lead bite. Un unless you are unless you're in torrent, then you do just water footsteps. Okay, so now Cooper's healing on Ivysaur. He's missing the kick. No. Come on. He has to heal this again. He I think. Yeah. He has oh. A... Well, I guess revive wouldn't work. I'm not sure. I mean, it would work, but. Oh my god, just hit Dude, the Dude, what is going on? I think... Oh my god, it's terrible. Oh my god, why do we use Mega Kick? Yeah, we just... We should just get rid out of... Uh, we should just get rid of, of this move. So pain, painful. And he has no Awakenings left, so... Okay, thank god. Holy... He's out of... Awakenings? So what? Yeah, he used both of his. Yeah. Then he has to pick up a, another berry later, which is... Uh, which just the same same... Yeah, yeah, the Chesto Berry. I the think that's Chesto. yeah. That's after the uh, the cut tree later, right? Yeah, it's it's on the route where you cut where where you cut your first tree or the sec second tree rather. Yes. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna have Bouncy enter the surge gym, the best place ever. Yay, fun! Where we're gonna dig through the trash to find some buttons to open up electrical gates. Does that make sense? It's a very easy puzzle. No one would ever mess mess it mess it up. <laughs> and no one would ever forget which which can they get first. Never. <laughs> so the so the I, uh, I, I, the idea is for for newer watchers that you have to check the cans and you have to find two keys and Bouncy just found his first key and now the second key to open the the gate to search is one of the four at at. Adjacent, adjacent. Yeah. yeah, and if he doesn't find it, he has to re reset. That's why he's safe now, and yeah. yeah so he basically the... has to find the next one. It's kind of nicer to... Um... No. Oh, God. It's, it's, it's nicer to have a first can land on one of the edges, because that makes the possibilities for the second can less. So you, you have to fight less. So you don't have to reset as much. But he's having a tough time. It's either the top can or the... Okay. Stuff. That's not too bad. Yep. Early can. And third try, second can. I mean, he he found the can really fast, true, and then he had four neighbor cans, and after two misses, he he got it. It's it was a good 50-50 chance. Wait, why is Cooper entering the Mars? Didn't Cooper shop be before and he, entering he did. as a time? He did. He's oh. Buying more. He's buying away awakenings. Smart. But for what though? Because he's out of, out of them. <laughs> oh, I, I, okay. I guess so. Uh, you don't want to just only rely on the Chesco Berry. I guess. I mean, there are a lot of ch chances uh, later in the in other fights where you can get mul multiple steps. Okay, so Bouncy's uh, search fight is now going on. It's a very scary fight.
Oh, very early chance for Cooper as well. Yep. And you get a nicer one because there's only three options for the second can. Mm -hmm. Nope, that's only trashy. Okay, it's time for Raichu. This is a scary Pokemon. We really need a hit kick on this Pokemon. Yeah. And we need to oh, remember no. that he has the berry, so even if he misses the kick or pulls on his uh, next on his next try on on the try where Ra Raichu would die, he can oh he can no. have, have, have another try. Oh no, Bouncy's having a terrible fight. Oh no. This might just end up in a reset, honestly. I mean if he hit if he hits kick now he's he's good to go. Okay, hit the kick. Oh, Sit, citrus berry? Oh, so good. Can Kitty Water Pulse now? Uh, I, it, it's close. Yes, he could have done it. Oh my god, he, he can po potion this. He opts for the reset. He, okay. Yeah, I mean, it's 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 smart, smarter over, overall. I think it, he was three double teams up and par paralyzed. It's it's really not good looking for him. <laughs> yeah, and even though Super has the has the IP ops for a save, I, I like this because if Raju gets like double team set up, then it's just impossible to hit. Alright, our runners are now tied up once again. Like, what did I say? It, it, the death happened early, so plenty of time to prove. Both of them getting Sonic Boom, which is quite good because now they are almost guaranteed to be able to pulse pulls on Raichu. But it's never guaranteed because it's kind of weird, weird AI. Uh, yeah. It, yeah. We just pray now. <laughs> Bouncy is more likely to be able to, to be able to waterfall on turn 2, but we'll see. Okay, good start for Bouncy. Good start for yeah. Bouncy. Now just hit. Did you water plus it in? Come on! Oh no! Hey, Kuka's Citrus two. Berry. Nice, Kuka. Kuka's two. One more chance, he has one more chance. Come on! No! That, that was a range, I guess. And that's the second death for, Bun uh, for, for Bounty. It's still early enough in the game that there's a yeah. but he really needs to win on this fight. Yeah. Shock, shockwave for Bouncy did actually 43, uh, and the range is 37 to 44, which is quite quite sad that he died. Died. Oh, uh, it was on 43. Yeah. Okay, and this is kids how late search was was born. Okay, he gets shockwave, which is still in, again good. <laughs> Okay, I, I, I think he'll get through this time. Yes, of course. I have a good feeling about this one. Ah, uh, okay. Clu Clueless. Wait. Double, okay, now, double team. Now he'll hit. Oh. You are, you are a liar, Nerdy. <laughs> no, he, he just don't make it. Okay, that's one. Oh, he has to kick now. Yes, oh kick no. Now. Okay, that, that gives him an extra chance. He can kick and then go for waterfall setting. Let's go. Mm -hmm. I never, I never lie, bank. Clap, clap, clap. You never lied. Sorry, I, I doubt, doubt you. Never doubt. Okay, he gets through. Third try the charm. <laughs> and with this, Kuka takes the lead. Uh, quite, quite a bit. He gets. He gets the bike now, which makes uh, the next sections and the rest of the game pretty fast because now we have a bike and don't have to run anymore. And the bike also has a secondary use. Um, we're gonna see very shortly a, uh, a spinner. And in this game, we have the mechanics to run to bike. So we start running to make the to make a spinner face a certain direction. And then if we're able to mount a bike very, very, very quickly, we're able to just bike before the spinner has another another chance to spin and see us. Yeah, but the but the fun doesn't stop here. We have to hit we have, we have to hit more kicks. Yay! Yeah. Which we actually, actually do. Nice. After oh, this... he gets a one percent encounter on the grass. How oh, unlucky no. is this dude? It's okay. It's, it's luck preserving. <laughs> okay. This is what the kids call it now. <laughs> it's it's a coping mechanism, okay, Ben. 
Okay, Cooper takes both his kicks very nice. But I think it's ideal to start getting low HP uh, from, from now on. Uh, I think ideally you want to be close to Torrent, because I think Torrent is helpful for later stages. And there you can see the run to bite for Cooper. Yeah, he he messed it up a bit, but then he re he recovered pretty fast. So no no one saw saw the little oopsie. Yeah, good back there. Bangshi now also on the bike. Nice, you, you can feel the wind through his, uh, his hair now. Time for Bouncy to hit some kicks. Really hope he does. Oh, Kuka getting confused here, which might be actually help helpful to adjust his HP a bit more. Yeah, it's not too bad, but so it's quite a bit of time loss. Okay. Oh gosh. And get poisoned. Okay. Okay. That's, okay. If he hits now, it's actually not so bad. Yeah. Okay. So now, now we can set up his HP to whatever he wants for the future. It's nice if you get poison powder off the, off the bat, because then you don't have to waste any more extra time in battle. And you can just let the poison kick you. Yeah, okay, the ops are just antidote. Uh, I like this, because there's a scary fight coming up in a little bit. Yeah, the sc scariest fight in the, in the next cave, which we, which they would both en enter in a bit, is Martha. Martha has an Oddish and a Bulbasaur, and... Um, both of the runners, oh no, as Bong is on a, mod a modest, he has to fight by the Oddish, but uh, Kuka has to, or wants, in the best case, to kick both of them. Um, yeah, as I just said, he has to kick them, kick misses a lot, and this fight can go horribly wrong, or it can just uh, go very easy if you hit it. There's another hidden revive near uh, Alicia, right? Or no, not Alicia, Mark. Martha. Yeah, it's. I think it's uh, left of her. Yeah. But I never actually picked it up. But uh, it's somewhere left of her, but I don't know where. Okay. All right. So now Bouncy will save up a little bit of time from the Zavanna app. But he's also pretty high HP, so he I don't think he'll have too much trouble with Martha like that. I don't actually know when, when Cooker played this game the last or when <laughs> when when he last played played this game because he basically got world record, I don't know when it was two years ago or something, or one and a half years ago, and then he never played this game again. <laughs> maybe maybe a week af after that, but he got world record and stopped. And I have no clue if he's if if he still has the juice or if he. I mean, he's, he's, a, he's ahead in this race, so. Yeah, which is actually quite good, I think. I mean. Okay, so, Cooper's entering the Martha fight. This is a pretty scary fight. And it's happening. Okay. <laughs> and he gets slept again. <laughs> Okay, so it's pretty smart that he bought these awakenings for this fight. Come on, just need to just okay, okay, the ops for fire. Okay, now we get the good fight. Uh, the good move is a uh, bite arranger. No, bite bite always good. Okay. On on level thirty. Okay. I, I think I might be thinking of late search. Yeah, late search. It's it's a bit. Oh god, and he, he misses. Dies! Oh no. no! Did he save? I think he has a revive. Still. Yeah, he has a revive. But, but I he, don't he's think out of he's kicks. Yeah, he's out of kicks too. Yeah, he has to either bite bite or uh, or uh, elixir during the fight. Okay, maybe maybe he potions. Oh yeah, that's smart. 
Okay, now we just have to hit a kick. So there's even more time for Bouncy to catch it. Okay. Now just hit the kick. Okay, there we go. Uh, yeah, Razor Leaf crit was quite unlucky, but Razor Leaf has a higher crit chance than other moves, so it's not that unlucky, but it's unlucky that he went for, Ra for Razor Leaf where he has three other moves, you know? Do you know what the chance of crit is? Of Ra Razor Leaf? I think yeah. it's... 16%? I might be tri tripping here, but it's it's a, it's a lot higher than the usual 1, one sixty. Okay. Uh, one, yeah, that's 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 what I meant. 1 and 8, yeah. It's 1 and 8 to crit. 1 and 8 instead of 1 16, yeah, makes sense. Okay, now Bouncy is in his Bulbasaur fray. See how it goes. Goes for bite. And I think he gets through this, yeah. Very nice, okay. Without issues. Uh, bite, bite on Bulbasaur is actually a range. I, I think it's, it's a very good range, but you can miss it. So it was a bit, it was a bit risky to go bite, bite. But I didn't catch if he was out of pixel. He, he's also modest, so just kick, just kick, still kill if he's modest. Yeah, the kick always kills Bul, Bul, okay. Bulbasaur, no matter which nature you are. Okay, cool, cool. Boy, hit it, so just. Yeah. Yeah. The rest of the cave is just is just a few fights, like three more or four or four more. There's one run to bike. Uh, minute they both have have to do to avoid one one spinner. But the rest of the cave is pretty normal and no issues. Just water puts everything in, and we have it. And there's Wait, there's did, there's one one last kick they have to do. Did Darcy fight the top? No. Okay. No. He, he fought the bottom fighter. Okay. I think both of them do uh, the normal world world record route, which is early search into low XP route. Yeah. Yeah, makes sense. All right, I think we have a little bit of a chill time now for a little bit. We don't have to be super terrified of any fights. Yep, that's, now, that's right. Now we focus on execution. Let's take the time that way. Why did Cooker buy this? Is, ah, I think he's still out of, out of water poses. Oh no, he elixir. Is, no? is he trying to take damage? Maybe. Maybe it was to get damage, yeah. Because he's he's quite high if he wants to do X, X attacks with. Yeah, there's a there's a rival fight coming up in in about yeah 10 to 15 minutes, where you um, can do two strats. You either use X attack to go through this fight, or you use uh, additional X X specials. And if you do X attack strats, you wanna have a certain range of HP, which differs from like low 30 to high 40, maybe low 50. And Kuka wants to uh, minip this, or he he wants to. Add and adjust this HP to, to get or uh, to end up in this range. So he, he wants to take more damage, which he can also do in, in later fights. For example, the first Geo fight. Yeah, makes sense. I think that's that's the, that's the reason why he bit this uh, Meowth. Okay, what is he doing? Okay. Okay, safe pass. I respect it. Oh, yeah. But this was super safe. <laughs> I mean, if you haven't done it in a long time, it, it could just make sense just to play it safe. Yeah. Save, yeah. save. Yeah. No, go, uh, go on, uh, go on, please. Yeah, yeah, no, it, instead of hitting a trainer, yeah. Just hitting an option, just not hitting an option is the main goal. Yeah. If you're not going for like a world record case, if you're just trying to finish the run in a decent time, it's very understandable. Yeah, hitting options maybe loses you the, the the most of the time you can lose in in, in races. Uh, you wanna you wanna avoid this at at all costs, even if you have to do a back back manip or whatever. It's just two two seconds you lose there instead of maybe thirty or forty. Yeah, exactly. All right, Cooper is now out of tunnel. Yay! No more tunnel vision. And I think. 
Oh my god, I'm filled with some kids. How many kids have we missed so far? Way too many. Like, at least ten. At least ten sounds quite high, but I think you might, you might you might be right if you count all the search fights. Like I think even maybe like at least, at least a dozen. Yeah, but I think. I think that's the last normal accuracy kick we have to hit. Is that correct? Uh, the the poster rocket in the game gaming hall has has another red which yeah you, if you which don't have torrent yeah it doesn't die from water pulse non torrent but they they can both opt to play around that with bite or water pulse and still doing that but they can also just hit hit the kick haha <laughs> kick kick haha <laughs> <laughs> yeah haha <laughs> okay so correct me if I'm wrong but is, is there a second nugget in the underground paths that yes. there's about to run through okay yes. There's, so a he... second, there's a sec second nugget you can pick, you can pick up. Okay, so he might opt to pick up that nugget and then sell it. Well, let's see what he does. I hope he knows where it, where it is because, uh, as I said, Kuka is out of this game for a long time now. Okay, he didn't pick it up. Uh, no, no, it's, 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 it's later. It's oh. in the rocket hideout. Oh, it's in the rock. Oh, okay, yeah, now... I thought yeah. you meant the rocket hideout, sorry. Okay, now I remember where it is. Yeah, it, it's been a while. Kukir missed nine kits and zero punches. Oh my god. That is insane. 75%. Okay, he got torrent he, he got torrent now from the red which we just talked about. Now his HP is actually I mean it's not per perfect, but he he uh he is not as high as he could have been, which is good. Hey, both runners are actually quite close to each other, but just one fight off. Yes. Yeah, Bouncy picked up the pace after Kuka struck with with Martha quite quite a lot. Oh yeah, for sure. Now that spinner is really, really bad to hit, because I, I believe he has like five Pokemon or something. He has five or six, yes. I mean, they all die to one water gun or bite or whatever, but it's still five Pokemon, which also, which all lose a lot of time. <laughs> and also, uh, Kuka passed the nugget, which we were talk yeah. talking about. Maybe he didn't know yeah, that he was no. there? I think he'll pick it up on his own back, if he wants it. Could also be this. Yeah. Both both are fine, I think. Yeah. I don't think it was this time. Uh if I couldn't lose time though, it's 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 the same amount of tides. Yeah. But Kuka also having Kuka having exact torrent, which helps a lot for one of the next rocket fights. There's one Arbok, which is a uh, very favor no, it's not very fav favorable, but it's oh. a good range to 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 hit uh, with with water pulse. We'll see what his plan is later, I guess. Yeah, he did pick up the nugget. Kuka, please don't hit him. Oh. Thank you. Oh my god. Kuka, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah. yeah uh, this maybe you're just a little dizzy. Yeah, I mean he's out of this this game for so for such such a long time. I don't I don't uh, blame blame him for messing up move, movement or yeah, just no, not, not being that that fast. It's it's all it's all right, Kuka. Yeah, no, not at all. We believe you. Alright, uh, did you catch what HP Bouncy is on? Uh, he's, I think he's at 30, or also, yeah, he's like at 30 or 29, so he's also very close to, to, to Torrent, or should have Torrent. Fair or enough. maybe he's he's just out of Torrent, but we will see later. Okay, his movement is pretty smooth here, around oh, the so Dangerous nice. Spinner. Yeah. And during that Cooker to have high HP, that's probably the reason he has, um, or I mean, just a high HP IV. 
Uh, that's probably the reason he has Torrent right now. It just makes it so much easier to stay on Torrent if you have more HP. If yeah. you have more room to play with. Yep, yep. Yeah, and this, this rocket Kuka is about to fight now has uh, the Arbok, which we were talk talking about, which is a good range to it with water pulse now that he has tor Torrent. If he didn't yeah. have tor Torrent, he had to bite water pulse and he can glare and par paralyze you or poison you. And it's all losing time, so. Oh, Dante is not in charge, actually. Oh yeah, he's too too HP out of out of time. It's not the end of the world. No. I, I think it's like bite into water pulse to be perfectly fine. Fire box. And very nice to predict the range. And now we'll see him burn candy twice into evolution. Oh, we don't get double evolution during this time. Yeah. Still very very close race for sure. Yes. They've they've just both been screwed over. Yeah, the the luck the luck was so bad with 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 kicks. It's 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 insane. Also, that that they both get get screwed so much is is really unlucky. Yeah, but it's part of the game. At least they're not alone. And it's also fun for us and the and the viewers. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, <Nonsense>. Fun. <laughs> Now we have a big turtle. Oh! Yeah. Bouncy has to fight Water Pulse here as he's not in Torrent. Luckily, our flinches, which is good, and now Pulse gets okay. Yeah, so I think Cooper is out of revive, so he, he has a little bit of a scary fight coming up. It, it should go smoothly, but just be safe. Yeah. Because I think we're, we're he's about to get fly, so if you don't if you die here, you spawn all the way back at something like Cerulean, or like really far back. So it's just not worth it. But after after this time, we're gonna get fly, so it, it's not gonna be the end of the world if we wipe out. Yep. Uh, I wanted to check how much Mega Punch does with his nature. It does 28 max, so a crit actually might kill, as he is mild, and mild is a minus defense nature. Oh, he that's won't, not good. He won't get crit. I, I he will not. Uh, okay, that's good. I think he's okay. I think also. Oh no, please don't. Okay. Yeah, he's, he's chilling. He's fine, he's fine. This looks right. like potion HP. He is mild though. Uh, he, you, you tend to be a bit more. Uh, you want to have more HP with a mild. As I just said, it's minus defense. But potion, you should be just fine. He can just potion this and be happy All for right, the next. Bounce his turn. For the next rival fight. Okay, he's okay. I think that's good. Same fight, maybe? That's, that's fine. He's a little high HP, but I think that's okay. You can always. Yeah, that's uh, perfect. You can always stall an extra turn, I think. Yeah. I would even say Bounce's uh, HP is better than, than Kuka's. Yeah, possible. Because Kuka has to uh, potion where Bouncy doesn't. Okay, Kuka went to uh, door 3 for, for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that, man. Yeah, we oh, both right. of them, both of them doing a, a big haul of shopping now for for the rest of the game. They they load themselves they load themselves with X items which they will use for certain fights and for the Elite Four and Rival and all the dan dan da all the dangerous late game fights. Uh, yeah. yeah. And now Kuka is going to pick up TM, uh, HM Fly. I I keep I keep saying TM Fly because in German, Germany it's it's called TM instead of H, HM, uh, but it's here HM Fly, and uh, they will equip this to pit pitching, and then yeah they can fly around on a, on a very is, small bird. Is there another chance to pick up the T? Because I noticed uh, I I don't think Bouncy picked up the T yet. Um. 
I know with late surge that you, you picked up the T after you get fly because you're going back to Vermilion, but Yeah, I think usually you pick it up right before you use po uh, Poke Fruit on Sn Snorlax, but right. Kuka, Kuka right, okay. al already picked it up, I think. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so... Okay. I mean, you can do either way, but it... Uh... Yeah, after it's flying actually... from Lavender. Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. Faster. It's actually faster to uh, pick up the T once you are done with uh, the lav lav Lavender section. Yeah, makes sense. Did you catch if uh, either, either of the runners uh, bought an X attack? Yeah, both of them. Okay. And, I mean, cool. I'm 100% sure with Kuka, and I hope also uh, Bongshi did it, because his HP is very good for... Yeah, he bought yeah, an X attack. Ex he even has two. Very nice. And yeah, two, I, I think. Yeah, but why would he have two? Two X attacks? Trying to think. I, I, I understand two guards better, three guards better, but um... Yeah, I'm not sure. May maybe yeah. it was a mistake, maybe we'll see later, we'll see. Yeah, maybe this is also some uh, something we can ask ask him after the race, if it, if it turn turns out he didn't have, have to use it. Okay, so Kuka's having... A normal... okay. Yeah, no quick attack there is good. You, you don't want to get too much damage. You basically just now from now on you're setting up your HP for all the way to make it. So you you want to like have torrent and then just hold it all the way. So Bouncy is looking for some damage here. Actually, he does not want them the same type. So that's good. Maybe. Oh X what? Twice? He X attack twice. I guess that's okay. Maybe maybe to stall another turn. Oh, that, I, I, that would make sense if he bought the extra edge attack to stall with. Because he noticed he has a little bit of high HP in case he needs to. Yeah, but he can always stall with Water Gun on Guy, Guy, Guy Arados. Why would he buy two? Oh, why would he use another X, X Echo item? Uh, it, it probably evens out, and he doesn't need that sure of money. It, it, I don't, if he didn't need the extra money, then maybe it just didn't work, uh, matter. I mean, yeah, they are both through through the fight without any Mega Kick misses, uh, which is also funny because Mega Kick after one exact is 99% to hit. So uh, we have a we have a few incentives on Blizzard and Mega Kick misses. Uh, I personally have a have the incentive that that I donate five dollars for every one percent kick miss. And the funny thing is, on my race, on my run, my one percent kick missed. <laughs> he lose on both fronts. Yeah. What Bang is trying to say here, he's rooting for one of the runners to die. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I. On the other hand, I do not want to see any any kick misses or blizzard misses. I want to see crits in Geo's gym, though. Because I believe there's another incentive for that. Yeah, I, I think Chippy has it, bro. I believe so, yeah. yeah. Okay, now... I think we have a little bit of downtime again. Both runners have Torrent, so... They just one shot everything. And now it, it's just about setting up your HP. I Does Bouncy have low enough HP? What is 35 times 3? That would be 105. So uh, yeah. Bouncy is in a sit situation where he where he desperately wants to uh, get quick quick attack from the reds, otherwise he is yeah. uh, he, a little he bit might be too high HP. Yeah. yeah, he might be too too high for for Koga. Kuka's, Kuka's in a good spot. He can just, I believe, Orenberry is enough with three other level ups for Weezing and and um, and Muck. The the general idea for the Koga gym is that you want to have to uh, Torrent, but high enough that you tank Sludge from Muck and Weezing. And this is for the for most of the runs. It's around 30 to 35 HP, which you need. Yeah, but in Cooper's case, it'll be a little bit higher since he has a mild turtle. Yeah, um, yeah. yeah. 
But yeah, I definitely had rather have lower HP than higher HP, because if you remember, they picked up the Ormberry earlier in the run, and it's a lot easier to manipulate your HP and get a little bit more than get a little bit less, because to get a little bit less, you need to damage from something, which it's, it's not always guaranteed to damage you, so it's a little risky. Yeah, but it's still very good to see that both of them are very close. I mean, the run is now 1, one hour 20, 20 minutes almost, and they are ba basically not neck to neck, but they, but they can see see they they can see each 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 other. Yeah. Wait, wait, what? What happened with Bumsy? Did Did he oh, I think I, I I I think he ran from the Marowak and it pushed him back. He needs to kill it. He's forgotten that. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> this is definitely a very weird run here. First, the Viridian Forest. Maybe, maybe he just hasn't played the game in a while. <laughs> First of all, he buys two x x. He buys two x x x two x x attacks. He runs from Mer Merowak. What is what? What is going on? <laughs> he's so he's also different. Awesome. The different. New strats confirmed. It's just a Koga minute for for later, right? Oh yeah. So now he now he's gonna get a quick attack. Yeah, all the quick attack minutes. Yeah. It's just... Yeah. If 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 Bouncy doesn't get quick attack, he. I think he has to do some weird super potion strats or like beginner strats or whatever. I I I wouldn't know what I would do. Maybe just super potion strats. It'll be interesting for sure. I think uh, Kukra on the other hand does not want uh, to attack this. He's already pretty low HP, and a crit might be close if, if he gets both. Uh, it'll, I mean, it, one one crit attack is fine. Then he then he can just potion and and he's pretty safe for, for yeah. Kukra. As yeah. safe as you can be. If he doesn't get quick attack, he just he can just all or in, which is also risky. Okay, he gets quick quick attack. Yeah. That's okay. good. Now he doesn't no. want to see quick attack. Yeah. Okay, fine. Okay, very nice. Yep. Okay, now it's down his turn. Now yep. he really wants to see. Really, really, really. See he quick needs attack. this quick quick attack, man. He is praying to all the gods now. Kuka picking up the pokey flute, which is mandatory to get past Snor uh, Snorlax in in a in a bit. Um, what is what is he doing? Wait, he what? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he, he gets he... quick attack! Woo! Okay, that's... Oh! That's even good, I think. Yeah. So now I think he can Orn Berry and sleep. Very, very nice HP, I think. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's he's safe. If he just or if he just Orn Berries, yeah. Yeah, very, very nice outcome for him. Yeah, he didn't need that crit, but now he has to use the berry, which can be also used later for E4. But it is what it is, you can just use it on Ko Kogana and, and be happy for the moment. Oh yeah, I guess Thornberry can also be used for Agatha. I don't I don't think I've seen it before though. But very yeah, it's very possible it can be used actually. After right after Bruno. Alright, let's see Kuker's pa bike passes. Okay. <laughs> I don't run this game, so I have no clue if that was safe or not. I did not look too safe. Uh, the first part looked quite safe, the second part was was something else, I guess. <laughs> okay, we that was just talk, getting his tea now. Oh, the tea. And now we're gonna see Bouncy's spinner passes. Let's see some think... nice, clean, safe passes here. Oh my god, Safari Zone. Safari Zone music. Yeah. Man. Child childhood memo memory. <laughs> yeah. 
Alright, let's see this. Yeah, okay. Okay, nice. Yeah, I think his his pass was a was a bit safe safer, but it doesn't yeah. matter now. Both both didn't hit any op options yet for the for the whole run even, which is quite good. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I can't actually hear the music, but I'm imagining it in my head. Yeah, it's the same music when Pokemon here and um, evil next gen. Alright, I think is, is this surf that gets you? Yeah, it's surf. They are super lucky for winning for w winning this prize, no? Yeah, very, very lucky. And no one beats them to the punch. I wonder how the rival gets served. Yeah, true. Okay, so now Future's entered at Koga's gym. Where there's a couple spinners, but just, we just bag minute all of these guys. It's not too hard. And also in this menu, I think he's also going to heal to get his desired HP. Yeah, he'll heal now. Yeah, potion. I... I don't... Does he live? Slush Pop? I don't know. Uh, he it's... does. He is, he's at 33 HP. He will level up one more time for the mark. Okay, okay. If he levels again, then maybe... Yep. Yeah. He's he said Muck does um, 33 max with his defense comp. Okay, how, how about Weezing? How much does Weezing do? Do you know? Uh, yeah, Weezing. Let me put up my big brain, aka notes. Weezing does 37 max, but for for Weezing he also levels up one more time, so he's also safe for for Weezing. Okay, then that's perfect. Very yeah. very nice. Yeah, Kuka's actually pretty safe. Bouncy's HP is also pretty good because he just has to Orin and is safe for both of the fights. Uh, interesting to see whether Kuka or Bouncy will nevertheless save, which is a good option, I think. Even though you might have re revives here, I'm not sure though. Yeah, it might be a good idea to save just so you can keep Torn, because it, it's pretty important to keep Torn for Blaine and then Erica. It, it's pretty nice. Um, so saving is definitely a good option here. Yes. Alright, it's time for Cooper's fight. Let's all pray. He didn't save. He didn't save. Wait, he didn't save. Oh my god. Mad lad. <laughs> yeah, the, the the painful part about Muck is that Muck is very fa favorite to use. Uh, what is the move in Eng English again? Uh -huh. Astar. No, the other one which you use Minimize? Not... Minimize! Thank you, I only had the German name. Minimize, <laughs> yeah. And, and then, yeah, surf ac accuracy drops, ob obviously, but... He uses Toxic?! Oh god, that's not good. That is very to toxic, man. Okay, I think he's gonna... Super potion, maybe? Uh, he can just go, actually. He can just go for Surf Wedge and hope that he just gets it. But Otherwise, it's just, he... It's just incredibly bad if he misses it. Yeah. Wait, does he even live another? I don't know if he lives another toxic tip. Oh yeah, true because it's bad, bad he poisoned. And oh, he's he's, poisoned. oh god, he four scores. That's not good. Okay, Bouncy's guess... definitely gonna save. Oh, that's so good. That's so lucky that he got poisoned. Yeah. Now we now we can just surf, surf, and it's just out of out of the fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bouncy oh, also wait. did save. Oh god. Is this a repeat of uh the of uh, moon rocket? I mean Kuka's Kuka's high high ad advantage is now that he can ad adjust his HP that he actually needs and wants for the for both of the next gyms, which is insane. That's true. Let's see if Bouncy can get a little bit of a catch up here. Yeah. But he, uh, Cooper also needs to keep count of his HP now. 
Yeah, Kuka is, has a speed IV of 30, so we can just go to as low as he wants. 25 is enough though, but he he could have even he could have even gone low. All right, now we're praying. Nice. Nice. Okay, he gets the bike flinch. Awesome. Okay, so bouncy is gonna save good amount of time there. Yeah. No Koga resets, which that's is what awesome. Love to see. Yeah, that's that's nice. It's just it's it, it's a low death race, but it's a very high kick miss race. <laughs> I'm gonna see how far they are for I think they're quite close. Big city. Wait, what is <laughs> Bouncy deciding to uh walk a little bit for getting on the bike? <laughs> Both get HM4, which is HM Strength, which is uh, primarily used for the vic victory road section where you have to push boulders around. And we teach that either to Sancho if we have it or Nidoran, and if we don't have either of them, we just te teach it later to Blast Blast Toys. Blast Toys. Yeah, it seems like Cooper has about a 30 second lead over Bouncy. It's still a very close race. I think there's a swimmer here that has a very low chance of... Yeah, if she walks... if she surfs twice to the left, she can see you, right? Uh, yes, it's actually the... It's, it's, it's a very low chance. It's one in, I think, 200 something something. I'm old. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Just a gen one miss. I don't yeah, know what those I, odds. I actually got hit once by her in all of my in all of my attempts, I think, oh. two, <laughs> two years ago. But it, actually on a good paced run, but it... It it just happens, and I That's... didn't even know that I didn't even know that he could see see you if he swims twice to the left. But it is what it is. That's so unfortunate. Okay, it's so a... taking up progress here. It's a learning experience. Oh yeah, for sure. Ooh. So, Cooper, I don't think he needs the progress because he has 30 speed. But if his bounty has a little bit less speed, he's going to be either using it for using this progress for either Blaine or Sabrina or both. Uh, Kuka actually picked up the card as he needs it for Sabrina. Oh, oh okay, he, okay. Yeah, he doesn't need it for Blaine, but he has to use it sometime before the before Sabrina before Sabrina, so he doesn't have to X speed on Venomoth. And Bouncy picked up the card because he has to use it before Blaine, which he does now. Yeah. And Bouncy has to X speed uh, on Venomoth every every time with okay. uh, 26 speed speed every. Makes sense. It shouldn't be yeah. too bad. Mm, now the only downside is that uh, you could get confused by Psybeam, which is 10%. Yeah, but but this never happens, right? This never that happens. never happens. Why would this ha happen? Nothing happened in this race, which which was bad. Yeah. Okay, so let's see if anyone gets unlucky Blaine. They're looking pretty good so far, Cooper's through. And he has his perfect HP setup for Blaine. Yeah. And I think he'll also keep it for Erica as well. Uh, he should be at 25 HP or 24, something, something. Yeah, isn't there an Erica strat where you can add special at the beginning of the battle and just serve instead of going for Blizzard? Uh, the safety sweat you are talking about is you X back on tang Tangela so that you can just serve while, while you are in Torrent. Yeah, I think, Otherwise, yeah. Otherwise I, you would have to hit a wizard. I really, I really like that strat. I, I like yeah. the strats. Yeah, it's, it's one of the best race, race strats if you ask me. Because the... Tang Tangler basically uses only two moves, Giga Drain and in Ingrain is the move, I think. And it's very, very favorite to use Ingrain because it never kills kids with Giga Drain if you are at that HP, which which Cook has. Yeah. Now we Unless have it. both our runners on the same bike. Is Bouncy gonna keep Horn for next? Oh. Oh no. He actually needed to hit this fire, fire Blast. And now he hit it, of course. Watch, watch this burn. Yeah. 
<laughs> I mean, if you get burned here, you actually have to full full restore because you do have no chance of getting rid of the burn. You don't have fire fire heals. <laughs> or is it burn burn heals? Burn heals. Burn heals, is it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wait, why didn't they stay broken down the gym? Wait a second. I remember, it's the most important yes no type spots that start to come up in the game. Yeah. Just don't use the A button here for a full minute, just click on B. <laughs> oh, okay, Jupiter presses the right. Okay, let's see if Bouncy finish off this art tonight. I think he can also go for the at special character strats now if he wants to. Uh, as he is modest, he yeah, they are they are both fine. Vibrum does 30 max to to both of the run runners. And they're gonna be rare candy, right? Yeah, yeah. Bouncy levels up three more times, and Kuka twice, uh, also three more times, ob obviously. So they are both out of Giga Drain range from Tang Tangler. So they. This this gym is smooth sailing say, now. Yeah. And then so and then we're gonna be called it heading over to Soap where we have yet again another uh, rival battle. Risky risky battle. Risky rock, rocket? What? Oh. Risky risky rival. Risky rocket? What? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm just I'm just um, addicted. You are. Okay, so now he gets to this yes or no chat spot. Very, very important. It's time for them to get there. What is this? The is this the sixth badge? Uh, or seventh it badge? Is this is it sixth. I, I don't know if it's the right order, but it's it's their sixth badge. I think they still have to do yeah, Sabrina so and Giovanni up. Giovanni. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, usually, okay. usually, if you did the gyms in the uh, order as intended, Erika is the fourth gym, but uh, <laughs> as, as we are speedrunners, we change the order, of course. Yeah. What up with the raid? Thanks, dude. I hope you're streaming as well. Welcome to our small group here. We are doing also some speedrunning. Hey, what up? Welcome, man. Wait, Tangular crit incoming. Oh, no. XDD. What is he saying? Clearly, it's not gonna happen. Own, he is cursing his own run. No, don't do God. it. <laughs> he was so young. I, a Giga Drain normally does from Tangela around 20 something. I'm not really sure. But if it actually uses Giga Drain and crits, I am donating 10 subs. <laughs> Tangle can also use other moves, right? Like, like Ingrain might be one of them? I, I'm not sure, Ingrain, but... Okay, okay. I really, really don't hope that he quits. <laughs> okay, let's see it. He's too special. Oh no! Wait! Oh, <laughs> That was actually close. Dang, I, I mean, almost had to say goodbye to the bank account. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright. Now it's smooth sailing. Now it's Bouncy's turn. So, I mean, yeah, Bouncy will just do the same. Yeah. And now, Cooker, uh, let's see. Is it, he might use Super Potion and then use a potion. Yeah, he has to Super Potion and Potion because Super Potion would be would be enough as he got Giga Drained. Yeah. Yeah. The next session for Kuka is uh, the, the 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 Sylph Hideout in um, the next city we're gonna we're going to go, and he has to do a small menu and then fight rival. Uh, I think it's the fifth rival fight totally. I think yeah. And he definitely has to save for this fight because we set up some X items and we have to hit at least two 93% blizzards. And if he misses one of them or either of them, he is most likely dying. So he has to save for this fight. Yeah. 
Okay, so Bounty's through. I think he also got the drain, but he loses it on 8 HP. Oh my god, okay. That scientist also has a lot of Pokemon. I think it's 4 or 5 Pokemon, so very important that you don't hit him. Now we're back in the to get the pass to the spinner, and he's gonna do his, all his healing and I think a lip an elixir on the, one of the menus. Pass him. Wait, it's going to turn. There we go. Yeah, he uses the card now, which he picked up earlier, so he doesn't have the, he doesn't have the X speed uh, on that Venomoth later. He max he max uh, elixirs to fill up his PP again, potions and potions, and then. He doesn't super potion? Uh, he doesn't potion? Oh okay. no. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you call it Bouncy did, but he went into the wrong uh, went the wrong way to get to the soap entrance. I did catch catch that though, I was fo focused on Kuga. Yeah. <laughs> oh, um, only a tiny bit less speed. Yeah, okay. Uh Kuga might super potion turn one on the what is Kuga? Ooh! <laughs> huh? Okay, I've never seen I've never seen this trend. It's a hyper potion. Oh, he picked up the hy hyper potion because he used the full full restore on the co Kogan. Yeah, that's fair. And he didn't save. Oh god! Oh my god! I just, why? Okay. My heart. I didn't even know that there was a hyper potion there. I mean, me either. Why he is the world record holder, not me or us? Wait, he's only on sixty-five. Yeah, that's why he super focused turn turn one. This is also a stretch you can because maybe I thought he thought that 85 HP was too low because he smiled, and that's why he wanted to go to 95. That's okay. the super potion turn one. Yeah. That's that's very smart. I don't think I've seen that strat before, but it's very very smart. Yeah, valid 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 strat. Yeah, I respect that. Okay. Have you ever seen anyone go for a double attack here on this fight? Uh... I I believe you can do it, but it's okay, really okay. not it's really not not used to. I mean, you can if you want to go super safe, especially if you did save, but then you must then you yeah give Dancy. pitch order not not try to crit. Oh, Dancy also did not save. These guys are onto something. My heart. Kuka hits both it's of his blizzards, which is nice. Very nice. Yeah. Okay, Bouncy is having a good setup. Yeah, I think Bouncy double X X it because he's very high, very very high HP. Yep, and he does okay. Okay, very cool. Yeah, Bouncy basically threw this fight as Blizzard is now at, I think, also 108 uh, at 100 percent hit or at 99.9999. Yeah. I don't think it's 99.999, but I think it's 99%. Or something around that. But yeah. Yeah, but both of them not saving actually. Oh, Koka. <laughs> rookie mistake. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's preventing content. It's for content. Was a, what I wanted to say was uh, both of them not saving here actually saved them a good amount of time. Kuka just lost this time because he let he he let uh, the rocket see him, but it doesn't it's matter. It's okay. It's okay. He's making he's keeping it close. Yeah, whoops! Oh, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? He Wait. blizzarded because <laughs> he he wanted to take damage. I th I, th I think if no, if I was uh, yes, he no. wanted to take damage. There's no way he wants damage here because the Tango is a little scary. He or I guess he damage. wants to hit the range. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He wants to take damage because he doesn't take damage on Venomoth. What he can do also is uh, X special on the Nidorino from Gio from Giovanni, which we will most likely see because otherwise he levels out of Torrent uh, for the yeah. next level. I, I remember I I was in Torrent and I've died in this candy candy spot multiple times. I've missed the range. I know it's um thirteen and sixteen, I believe. It is indeed eighty one percent. Yes. He doesn't expect it. Okay. Okay. He goes for the. I think this is a safe play. I mean, he could. He, he can also. 
bite surf on Ken Kangaskhan? Or just, I don't know. Maybe, yeah. even though he doesn't need to do it, he can still X-Speed on Venomoth to just tank this beside beside me. There's a lot of ch chances he can take damage here, although. Yeah, there's a lot of spots. See, this for sure. Gets the range, okay. Wait, that's a that's a range out of out of torrent. Wait, is he, he in torrent? He's still in torrent, yes. Oh wait, I intend you now. Exactly. Wait, oh, 141. Okay, okay. Yeah. He, yeah. He loses it. He loses it. He loses it. Loses it. Oh god, god. At the next level up, but um, yeah, we will just see how he does the Sabrina jump up. I mean, he man. Torrent is not mandatory for the Geo for the Giovanni gym, just for some Pokemons he, ha he has to fight them. But it it weakens his surf count, so I'm very excited or interested in how he's gonna hand handle this. Alright, Bouncy also hits Tang Tango range. Very, very nice. So I think Bouncy is chilling. Chilling like a villain. Okay, so let's see what Cooper decides to do to get because it's really really important to get into Torrent for Giovanni's gym. Ooh, he has specials on the Kadabra, I think. Yeah, he needs to he, he he needs to expect anyways because he will level out of Torrent on the next level. Wait, I don't know about this. I think he's I I I I think he's fine. Yeah, that's why he double ex expect because he. Expected him to use calm, calm mind. Yeah, but now he's out of torrent. Okay. Yeah, but he expect twice. Okay. I, I'm just talking about future. How he's gonna, how he's gonna get back into torrent for the gym. I guess he will expect now, or he just says screw my tor torrent. Okay, he's gonna. Okay, yeah. Him. Dark spin makes sense. All right, cool. Now he's on good HP. Yeah. Yep. And Bouncy's gonna XP it on Venomoth, and he's just chilling for HP. Yeah, both of them on 40 H HP, which is also a good set. And on the same fight. Not just for long, two. But... Yeah, just two two Pokemon uh, be between them. Yeah, it's very, very close. Yeah. Bouncy pick, 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 pick up the pace, quite good again. Psybeam, nice, no confusion, really good. Very solid. And nice HP, I think. Yeah. Yeah, the last gym they have to visit now is the Viridian City Gym. It's the last gym, the Geo Gym. And all, it's the all of them, yeah, all of them are fighting on ground Pokemon, and he just everything dies to surf or water pools. Like it's the most boring gym of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I think it's still around 30 seconds. Uh, does Guard Spec prevent confu confusion? I think that's what Cooper's asking. I'm actually not sure. Uh, I don't think Guard Spec does that. Guard Spec only pre prevents status as uh, status drops. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, he was he was thinking about a, a, a different item. Nice try. Huh? Yeah, I Wait a Confused. I was a bit confused why he opted for guards back, but it didn't change the out the, the outcome. <laughs> I can always surf in Geo's gym with no torrent and get back to the surf. Oh yeah, true. Yeah, there's a is the hidden item in uh, Giovanni's gym a elixir? I know it's by the one of the um, by, by one of the pads. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and say. Yes, but I have no clue. Oh, <laughs> it's just the 4E4. Okay. okay. Kuka, uh, you are you are fine. You can you can water put every ground ground Pokemon here. Just water puts everything in turn. It's fine. Maybe he means out of form. He means out of form. Okay, we're back on the same fight. Neck to neck. <laughs> neck to neck. Go for 
you're getting side assistance from a main in chat. <laughs> is this allowed? <laughs> is this allowed? Is this, is this co uh, co uh, coaching? <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I, I, I just want to say it doesn't matter because he has taught, he has taught, he has taught, and he can water pulse everything. But <laughs> it doesn't matter. This, this gym is very boring. Boring. Yeah. But after this gym, we have like the final stretch of the game, pretty much the the second final rival fight, victory road, and then the very, very difficult. I think the Elite Four in this game are probably one of the hardest to leave. At least for speedrunning. In in any of the game. Very difficult. Because there's so many decisions you have to make. There's a lot yeah. of country that can go around. Yeah, a lot of sketchy fights, especially uh, Bruno is a very com complicated fight. Ag Agatha can can screw you up multi multiple times. Yeah, for sure a very uh, cha challenging Elite Four, as, especially for the first three gens. I don't, I don't know about four and up, but these games also don't don't matter really. Yeah, I I think yeah, every, every fight can kill you, but they'll they'll probably not say for the warlike because they can heal out of the crit range. But every fight can be scary, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, because it's a lot of time. Yeah, you definitely want to save for Bruno and Ag Agatha, and uh, uh, knowing both of them, they they just want to finish the race. They, I don't think they care much about seeding or getting pot one, pot two, which uh, which uh, guy I want to face in the next round. Jay, they will most likely save for four out of five fights for the heat four, and then uh, they have a safe safety net. Yeah, and I I like the idea of double uh, as after saying for Lance. That should make uh, that fight not too bad. Yeah, but yeah, just want to finish the race. As long as they both finish the race, they make it onto the next round, which is very nice. Exactly. Luckily, or I mean, luckily, let's let's call it like let's let's call it that. Uh, the third race are forfeited before the race, so both of them uh, will advance automatically to the next round. No, no matter with what time, they just have to finish the race. Okay, Cooper, I think. Cooper gonna save? I, I think he will. Does Cooper even care? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> he saves. <laughs> okay, awesome. Funny story. I I think if you die in this rival fight, you get spawned back at. Uh, uh, Cinnabar Island, Poke Center. Believe it or not. Yeah, for some reason. I, I do why, but I just remember it happening to me sometime when I was running this game. Very confusing. Yeah, also that you are ran randomly spawned in uh, Cer Cerulean City after you died to, I don't know, mid, mid game fights, also very weird, but it's po Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah, both of them now on the same fight, on the same mon, quite tight. Setting up X items, having to hit uh, a blizzard in, on the next mon, 93%. Oh wow, I didn't realize there was just close to a Cooker didn't kill. I think Cooker is out of this very tight on serves, otherwise, I cannot imagine why he would water put. Okay. Wow, the aim is so close now. Actually. I really, really need to hit this blizzard. So important. Oh, did we see any crits in Giovanni's gym? I forgot to count. Oh, I didn't. I didn't fo follow them. But Chet also didn't follow them. Bad Chet. <laughs> oh, there wasn't just any crit. Could have. Could have also been. Maybe. Uh, they will both get past the Venusaur. It could not be closer. Yeah. But we're we're coming up for a very exciting finish. Oh, Clint here is nice. Yeah, actually, actually on the on the same one, it's insane how how close both of them are. Uh, is Bouncy able to skip at speed with his HP? Does he lose uh, really a psychic from Alka's hand? 
60 max. Give me a second. He is modest. He can tank this, yes. Nice. So he, he saves a little bit of time even. Yeah. I think he can, yeah. I mean, Rain is actually slower than Expeeding, okay? Maybe Aww. maybe he doesn't know or he didn't have his notes open, but it's maybe it's just a safe, safe, safety play for him. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, but he would have tanked it, so, so I didn't. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. We love our optimizations in speedrunning, though. Yeah. But now that he expeded, he is definitely faster. So he, he is not in dan danger to getting random randomly psychic or crit or whatever. Kuka, please. Kuka, you have a bike. Please step on the bike. Oh my god, he has got off the bike. Thank you, Kuka. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to keep it close. He's trying to keep it close. Yeah, he, he gives him a chance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good guy, Kuka. And I think that was the last chance for... Oh no, they super fell, but no one got a 1%. Yeah, I'm, oh, yeah. I'm very, I'm very excited, excited how Kuka will handle the uh, the vic victory belt section because um, you are actually quite tight on steps. So if you uh, bonk too often or you misplace some boulders or you do I, additional steps, you might get an encounter on the I, on the way up. I think uh, Kuka super held after the the grass before the play, so I think he has a little bit of time to play around with. Okay, we, will, we, we will see this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I like the optimization for Bouncy talking to the guard instead of letting him see him for the yep. Thunder Badge. Very nice. It's such a tiny thing. I mean, this is just high, high end play. Yeah. It's what you'd love to see. Yeah. Some small detail. Oh, he's taking strength now. Oh, yeah. Pushing around some borders so the the, the 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 blocks vanish. He can pass through. You you definitely don't want to hit any optional here because all of them are very very annoying. You are basically out of serves, which is your main main move, and uh, you just want to avoid time loss, doing sketchy fights, and yeah, that's that's all you want to do. Do that's all you want to do. You push some borders and be happy with your life. Small missteps from Bouncy. Oops, Still looking uh, all right. Is Did, okay, okay. Oh, what? Oh, he, okay. He risks a few steps just to make it all the way through. I mean, I mean, I mean, it's not really risk risking. I think, I think three or four tiles are fine after the super repel. I don't really know, but. I think I think it was fun. I, I thought it was only uh, seven steps out after the uh, after the stairs, but I wasn't counting. Yeah, I mean counting is hard, you know. Counting is hard. Yeah. Good, you did miss that boulder. You're not wasting wasting your time. All right, I don't think. I think we're chilling from now on, for sure. Bouncy to just get past a few more optionals. Oh my god, okay. Okay, that, okay, Cooker's now out of Victory Road. Oh. Very nice. Oh, last towel. That is flying as fuck, yeah. Sorry for cursing. Bouncy is gonna have to risk a few tiles, yeah. No, you were right, Cooker timed that perfectly for the super about. Let's see his deposit now. I think he has one. HM friend is dead. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> oh no! Oh. One in box one and one in box 40. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Apart from that, it was pretty clean. Yeah, basically, Kuka's race was. A Apart from all the bad luck he had with games <laughs> and other stuff, his race was actually pretty clean. I didn't expect him to come to come back to this game so strong. I mean, there are there are still five fights on the table, but very very solid job. I'm actually very proud of him. 
<laughs> Pusher is slightly ahead. He's entering the Lorelei fight. Now, do you think we're going to see Halos from Reboot? Uh, maybe. I I just go ahead and say yes. We will see one, uh, one Halos fight. I don't think so, but... Here's the whole thing. Uh. Okay. Turn 2 Hail is not too bad. It's... So does it turn 1, and it's expected to be so It'll run out in time. Okay, yeah. Dom's his turn. Maybe if he can get it, he can save a little. The general idea for both of them is now to go uh, to use 4x, 4x specials so, so that the du Duom is a, is a 2 shot and that La Lapras is a 3 shot. And um, yeah, the only, dif the only dif difficult part about this fight is Hail. Oh. Hail is pretty normal. And uh, yeah, they both will most likely save for uh, Lapras because body slam crit is very bad and can kill. No, no Hail for Bouncy. Very nice. You were right, uh, Ben. Did anyone doubt, doubt me in chat? <laughs> See? And this also means they are neck to neck. They are actually very, they are, they are within oh my God. one, two seconds. <laughs> no, pr no protect for either No protect. Nice. Oh god, this is actually pretty high. I think this, this might be, this might be the clo closest race of all the round one round races. Hey Trilly, good to have ya. Could not the have a closer race here. Exactly. Oh my god. The... <laughs> they are oh they are so close, oh my god. <laughs> it's it's almost it... synced up. Oh. My brain can't handle ha my brain can't handle this. Oh safeguard, no, why would you do that? <laughs> oh Safeguard the part party for good. Good thing for Ku Kuka is Kuka doesn't have to doesn't have to heal. Bouncy might opt to heal if he gets one body stand because body stand crit kills him. But maybe we see some flin flinches. Flinch Go for Kuka. Oh yeah. my god. Oh my god, what is he doing? He's ris risking it. Uh, Kuka got two flinches. Bouncy got a very good flinch and both of them are done with the fight. Uh, Bouncy got one of the best lawyers I've, I've maybe ever, it, ever seen. It is insane. Oh, this is insane. The, uh, oh Kuka, please, please save for this fight. Thank you. Good. Bouncy, please save for this fight. <laughs> yeah, Bouncy will most likely go for... Okay, he potions. He might still go for uh, X-Special Strength. Okay, but... thank god. Both of them save, there we go. The rich get richer, exactly. <laughs> yeah, you wanna... You wanna de you wanna de defeat the first Onyx and leave Onyx uh, with high torrent so that you also have torrent for Ag Ag Agatha, but you also wanna have two X specials set up and be faster than everything on this fight. So this is actually a pretty sketch a sketchy fight. Yeah, you need torrent for this fight. Okay, earthquake. Oh, he's gonna be too low, isn't he? Uh, if he sees if he sees rock rock to now he is fine. Twenty five is definitely too too low. He has his proportions. I think Bouncy has perfect HP and Bouncy is taking the lead. Yes, Bouncy is fine. And Kuka is also fine now. Both of them are in high torrent. Also not in death range to mech mech to to mech punch here. Both of them are fine now. Good. It is so close, nerdy. Oh my god, it's going back and forth, man. It all comes down to Agatha. Yeah. Then... Agatha will de decide here how many deaths we will see. I really hope they both get through Agatha. First try. <laughs> Kuka a little, maybe maybe a little bit speed up. <laughs> yeah, Kuka is going to one is, is going to one one hundred and ten and ten speed up. <laughs> See what the time difference is. Anything could happen, though. Yeah. To go to 38 or 39 for bouncing. 
and 20240 sets for Cooker. Eight second difference. Yeah, it's it's not even one one Pokemon dif difference now. Both of them are obviously safe for this fight because Gengar most likely will set up one or two double teams and then Surf gets um, gets Surf ac accuracy gets gets lowered by quite quite a lot. So it all comes down to hitting the Surf or or not. Oh boy. Shadow Punch 21 is really bad. Oh no, no, it's really good. Now he can Super Potion, he will Shadow Punch again because Shadow Punch will kill now. And then he can Super Potion again. Oh, he just sets up now. No, he, he, he sets up. He's fine for Shadow Punch now. Wait. No, dude. And Cougar's okay. too. And Cougar is now in the lead again. Yeah. Just hit. Oh my god, this is Duncan. Yeah, Bouncy has some difficulties with healing because he got Shadow Punch turn 1. Cooker had a, I would say, pretty st standard fight. And this is why he also takes the takes the debug again. It, it, it's pretty much the Bruno fight reversed. Yeah, true. Oh my god. Nah, Cooker is not losing torrents. He, he's not losing torrents. Nah. He's fine for at least three, three more minutes. Yeah. I can't have the same dude. <laughs> dude, that is hard. Yeah. Even though it's my major. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> you did That's... some wrong. You you did some wrong cho choices in your life. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, the rest of the fight is pretty stand standard. Just spam A and serve. Every every everything dies in one hit. All right, let's see what the time difference is now. Super finishing at. 204.45 Bouncy finishing at 204.50 It's incredibly close. I this is this is insane. After Broom Bruno, Bouncy was ahead five or six seconds or seven seconds, and now Kuka is ahead five or six seconds. Let Lance decide. Both of them heal 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 to full as we have to set up who would have thought some X items. Oh, he doesn't save! He doesn't save? Oh, that's pretty bossy. Now Bouncy's back in the lead. Yeah, Kuka basically has to save, I think, because Hyper Beam Crit might kill him as he's mild. And Bouncy is, is out of Hyper Beam Crit range, I would say. Yeah, Bouncy has really high defense, so he'll have a, better, a, much, a much better time with Hyper Beam. Bite for Bonk, or Bite good. for Bonk, and Bonk is very good. Also for Kuka, which helps a lot. Another Bite for Bonk, for Bonk. Wow, very good start. Good. Yes. And good does he tank from 85? Yeah, De definitely. He definitely tanks. Okay, no crit, come on. Oh my god, my heart. Both of them heal, heal to full, which is ne necessary. Hyper Any... Beam missed for Kuka. This is insane. This is wow. so good. Anything can still happen. This is so lucky for, for Kuka. Did Bouncy set up two with accuracy or just one? I... He misses oh! the range! I think he did ris Risky Land threat. Even though he is 31 special, he missed the range, which is so unlucky. I think it's... 80% something something to get the range with this fist and he that's, missed it. That's so bad. Oh, he crits them. Oh, uh, so many things hap hap happening here at the same time. Wait, wait now he has to do an elixir on a... Uh, on one of the Dragonairs, maybe? No, no, oh, he, is, he is fine with the Blizzard counter. Okay, okay. Oh my god. I would I would assume both of them went to uh, exact twice because they are, because they are not missing wizards. And, and uh, yeah. Cooker's back in the lead. It yeah. could not be closer. It's going back and forth. Okay, don't get the engine, engine power boost. Thank you, sir. Nice, good job. Oh my god. Oh, this is actually hype. Will oh. we see again? No save from from Bouncy. I don't think I mean, Bouncy. I don't think Bouncy's gonna save. 
No. I mean, if he if he doesn't save and he dies to champ, which could happen, he has to do three more fights again. He, he will spawn back at Agas. Uh, as long as he finishes his run, he's guaranteed to advance. Yes. So we'll see. Hmm? We'll, we'll Cooper save, let's see. Oh, Cooper he's just gorgeous. His money. Nice. He, he, he's making sure he has uh, the right turtle with the right ID. <laughs> Very much. Did he elixir though? <laughs> I, I'm not sure. Fun fun fact: In his world record run, Kuka forgot to uh, el uh, forgot to elixir for this fight and still got world and still got world record. Better times, better times. Okay. Bouncy also oh. save. Okay, okay, he goes for the save. Okay, he's just taking the second place. Yeah. Very very awesome time though, from both runners. Yeah, they will One. end up most likely at a. 12 something maybe which is still very good you want to yeah. see we you, you want to live in a de desert now you want to see sand attacks over sand attacks over sand attacks especially Kuka because Ar Ari Ace does definitely more to him because he's mild uh, this is not torrent my dude um... Wait... Did it's he go fine, right? I don't know if he went to press... Wait, wait, wait. The XX here, okay. He has okay. Blizzard and he, and he went to roll for him, very good. He, he has two chances now to have Blizzard. Okay. And he hits. Now Bouncy has hit another blizzard, or has hit his blizzard. Kuka, I don't, I, I, I don't want to jinx things, but Kuka is basically done with the fight. Don't so, say anything. Do not say that. <laughs> also hitting the blizzard for Bouncy, very good. I think both of them are very are in a very good position now to, to not die again. If they if they want to play this very safe. Yeah. They can heal on either Arcanine or the Sea, sea Snake or just heal at Yeah, they, they should be safe from now on if they if they heal correctly. Yeah. I mean Kuka definitely should save. Definitely. You mean heal? Yeah. Uh heal, yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I mean he has a revive. Shout it. Shouting. Dragon Rage, okay? Interesting, no no thrash for him. They're on the same Pokemon. Oh my god, it's so close. Arcanine crit kills him. Most most likely. Oh, I mean it's a it's a good chance. Arc Arcanine crit kills him. Oh my Should... god. That's he's still that... going for the Is he healing this? Yeah, I mean it's Wait, it's the right choice. Could Bouncy win if he goes for it? If he goes for it, so close! Oh my god! No, he also heals. Oh. Maybe, maybe he didn't know that Kuka also healed. Oh my god! He's he's strange. Wait, wait. What is happening? Bouncy's gonna win. Bouncy's winning. Bouncy's won. Actually winning. Wow, because Kuka's strength. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. I mean, same finish. I, I think it doesn't matter oh for my seating, God. but it matters for the end of this race. Bouncy oh wins this race. It's insane. Wow. Bouncy wins. <laughs> oh, I have no clue if... I don't know if Kuka did this on purpose because he doesn't care or if, 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 oh if he's just that shit. Oh, what an insane race. I mean, in the end result... Kuka oh save a pick God. Man. <laughs> He did it. He's reading the picture. He's taking. I also best. had Kuka on, on first. No, Kuka! <laughs> he saved his own. What? <laughs> he did this on first. <laughs> oh, he is, wow! If he actually did this on purpose to save his own pickems, this is Wait, a new level. Wait, is of that is that what Kuka meant when he said, "I'm not winning. I'm stalling." I, this is what he said <laughs> half half an hour ago. Yes. <laughs> No, five uh, minutes ago. Draws are actually right after this game. Uh, yeah, we so do stick some setup stuff and then drawing is actually right after this, this race. They both get...
part two. Yeah. Wow. Okay, Bounty finishing with a 2.12.33 and Kuka just eight seconds behind that 2.12.41. Congratulations to both of you. This was a pleasure to watch, especially especially E4. That was insane. Welcome, Bouncy. Glad to have you. Congrats on winning the race, question mark. Hello, Bouncy. He is muted still. Oh, hello, hello. Yo, Yo I cannot what's... believe it! I cannot believe it, I won! What? Do you also know why uh, why you won, maybe? Yes. He's okay. matched with some admins. <laughs> Please ban. <laughs> <laughs> So you were follow you were follow following the race on your on your own screen and, and uh, looking where where Kuka is. No, just at the end. Like for most of the race, I just popped in eventually. Welcome, Cooker. I, I was mostly trying to focus in, on my like, interesting game. finish. If I yeah, must GG, say so Kuka. myself. Hello. That was fun. Kuka, in all honesty, did you strength on purpose? Yes, of course. <laughs> You messed up my pick pickups, <laughs> man. And saved, and saved your own. Wait, Bouncy, I have a question. Yeah. In Viridian Forest at the beginning, do you know you can go around the grass at the, at the beginning? Wait, what? You walked up through the grass in the very beginning, like we do in like, red. But bef Before the forest or where? At, at the beginning of the forest when you enter. Oh my god, I forgot about it. <laughs> Yeah, it's just been a while. I, fair yeah. enough, fair enough. I, I did it. I did this also in practice. Oh my practice. god! <laughs> Oops. Yeah, uh, it's okay. I'm, I just wanted I'm to ask. Quite, I'm quite stunned. <laughs> yeah, and I just you, forgot about and it. And you still won. I mean, I won because he choked, and yeah, because, because I, I, <laughs> after I missed the range on Lance, I, I just knew I was going to lose. Wait, were you doing um the thirty ones uh, special thatch traps on Lance? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, that range is pretty bad. No, the I... range is actually 80, 85 something. Yeah, there. I have never I, missed it. I've like, never seen anyone kidding. hit it. I have never I missed mean, it. I mean, it's it's worth it, it's worse if you have 30 special, but on 31 special strats, and okay. if you if if you want to go fast, it's the strat you actually yeah. use. Okay, I thought it was worse than 80%. I did this one on, on chat. Oh my god, but the... yeah. Oh, wait, 31%? Oh, oh, you did this one. Yeah. Yeah. I, I didn't even know it was a range. Oh. Uh, yeah, the medikits were... It. The medikits throughout the run were just so bad. I think I, like... We either missed, like, uh, close to the same uh, the same amount, or I missed more. Because I swear, yeah. I missed so many, dude. I'm, I'm by by Cooper's count, he said he missed nine medikits. I need to count, but I missed a lot. I missed a lot. Like it just, was, just Bill, it was like four. I think it was so tragic. And then your two deaths, the surge. Yeah, that yeah. just ruined yeah. the run to me, like for me. Well, whatever. Yeah. But uh, made for good I, content. <laughs> yeah, for the last twenty minutes, you were basically neck to neck, always maybe at 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 most one one fight. Like, uh, at at yeah. each at each uh, at each other, each other's neck, it, it was quite a show for the last. It was like thirty ten, seconds apart minutes. for yeah. like a very long time. Yeah, since like Togo. Yeah, it was a, a, a nice run. I don't know if Cooker he tr he trolled like more than he should have <laughs> just for the PKMs. <laughs> like, or did he? Did you only troll at the end, or like, did you? Did you? No, make he, he, I, that was only at the end. Okay. I I I say basically everything. So when you yolo, you would gain time on me for everything. Okay. You guys but say it... you both. You guys did risky rocket. I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, and I was pretty first... proud. <laughs> it's I was risky if you have revive. Honestly. I was terrified the whole run. <laughs> also got chunk sick from knock, which was pretty funny. So... Yeah, that was a nice recovery though. Very nice. Yeah, tiny good lucky as well. Yeah, but you but you picked up the hyper potion the hide hide out so I I didn't I didn't even know that there was a hyper potion so that was a good play. But yeah, I I know I missed three kicks before boat rival, then I missed three on boat rival and three again on Martha. So that's at least nine. Yeah, you both had very bad very bad luck. Yeah. 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 I mean, uh, had a very fun race. I just what? didn't want to do any fights over, so I just I saved before everything. 
Yeah, like, makes sense. And, and, like if winning meant something, I wouldn't have done it. But winning didn't mean anything in this race, basically. Yeah. yeah. I that's, was trying to go for like a really good race time, but after surge, I was like, okay, <laughs> nah, it's, it's not possible. Does winning ever matter? Sometimes. It's oh, yeah, we yeah, only okay. play. We only play for fun, right? Oh. Okay, I think we're ready for the uh... the pigums. Okay, yeah. Uh... <clears throat> No, the, the, the draws for the next round, they're happening right now at this rate.